Toyota vehicles with hybrid synergy drive also include a feature called regenerative braking, which helps recharge the vehicle's hybrid battery while also assisting with braking. Typically, with conventional brake systems, the energy required to slow down a vehicle is converted to heat in the brakes and is effectively wasted. With regenerative braking, some of that energy is recovered and put to use by converting it to electricity and storing it in the hybrid battery system for future use by the electric drive motor, thus helping to reduce fuel consumption. Depending on the vehicle, one or more electric motors in the hybrid synergy drive system is mechanically connected to the drive wheels through the vehicle's transaxle assembly. So not only can the motor drive the wheels as when accelerating or cruising, but the wheels can drive the motor when decelerating. In that case, the motor can also act as a generator, resisting the rotation of the wheels, sending electricity back to the hybrid battery, helping recharge it. In other words, it does the same thing the normal brakes do, which is to slow the rotation of the wheels. The amount of that braking force is proportional to the level of electric current being generated. The greater the current, the greater the braking force. The system automatically allocates some portion of the braking force to the regenerative braking system and some to the conventional hydraulic brake system. There are two conditions where regeneration occurs. When the brake pedal is applied, when the accelerator pedal is released and the vehicle is coasting, that regenerative effect will be represented on the charging gauge. The proportion of regenerative braking varies with the vehicle speed and time of brake application, so the combined result matches the driver's input, providing normal brake feel. Regenerative braking is active whenever the shifter is in D, R, or B position. The braking effect is increased in the B position, However, the level of regeneration is not amplified by being in the B position. The effect is similar to the increased level of engine braking experienced when a lower gear is engaged in a conventional non-hybrid vehicle. The amount of regeneration is determined by the type of braking done by the driver, recouping the most energy under normal linear braking conditions. Depending on the vehicle, an energy monitor display may show when regenerative brake energy is being transmitted to the hybrid battery, as well as the amount of energy regenerated in the previous 15 or 30 minute period. It should be noted that it is normal for some sounds to be heard from the regenerative braking system when the brake pedal is depressed and the accelerator is released. The features and functions described in this video might not be applicable to your Toyota model. See your owner's manual for details. Thanks for watching this Know Your Toyota video.